The Northwest region is today the story of massive destructions, killings, kidnappings for ransom, and the virus of division taking roots among the population. This is all blamed on the socio-political and security crisis rocking the region since 2016. The economic and social fabric of the Northwest region has been torn into pieces, causing massive displacements. This is the subject that took Paul Tazong, National Coordinator of the Presidential Plan for the Reconstruction and Development of the Northwest and Southwest regions to Bamenda, with a plan to show in an attempt to restore the pride of the inhabitants of the English-speaking regions and help matters for economic recovery and social cohesion. But the average Bamenda man believes in a return to normal life, that is, an end to hostilities which has worsened their living conditions before meaningful development can follow. The reconstruction will be done gradually, from peaceful and secure areas to the more unstable areas. Nobody wants, in fact, to endanger the lives of workers or risk seeing the infrastructure that we will be rebuild be destroyed again. Yes, because people cannot live on assistance forever. It is a program of hope. Hope to have a house again. Hope to fly roads in good condition again. Hope to have water and electricity without interruption again. Hope to finally be able to see children go back to school. During the launch in Bamenda, Paul Achombang, Bamenda City Mayor, appeals the plan also considers teachers in the private sector. To look into the plight of the thousands of private teachers, We're referring to teachers of the mission schools, lay private education, they have gone for months and years without salary. And if they do have, it is terribly slashed, not even enough to sustain one person. They too, Your Excellency, need to need reconstruction. The people of the Northwest region therefore expect much more from the presidential plan. The Northwest region has been without a peace even as the local side, PWD of Bamenda, otherwise known as the Abaco Boys, will be playing international football in 2021 after grabbing the tickets on an unregulated peach. The Babaju Bamenda Road project is still begging for reconstruction since it was launched. It is hoped that Part of the over 89 billion set aside for the reconstruction process will be channeled towards the realization of these projects and also the ring road promised by the head of state, President Paul Bia.